So Disney is censoring The Simpsons. Okay, Disney is removing jokes from The Simpsons with widescreen episodes. So basically, we I I was feels what Disney's gonna do to the company Fox owned properties is now here. So for, so since the Simpsons is a Fox owned property, it was all the properties that came as a con. No, were not is now owned by Disney. Since you know Disney bought out all of Fox besides Fox Fox News and the Fox News and anything related to Fox News, they're actually still independent actually. But the Simpsons in us watch with some technical hiccups. The it irritated the Simpsons fans. You discovered that classic Simpsons episodes were cropped widescreen, not the full free, whereas it was FX. Excuse me for buffing. FXX. Brought back in 2015, that's like four years ago. And that decision wrecks um some sweat side gags. And the revolution that all those spears have come from the same source. Basically they changed it to stretch the um modern aspect TV ratio. We asked Disney to comment, basically Disney said, Oh, Disney had to take the hard to four free person. Give people with streaming since Disney owns FXX. It is but stopping the company posting those editions. Instead of the widescreen variants, so but that's not the only thing that they have done to the Simpsons, okay? And you have to see the Simpsons with these black bows, it's just annoying, okay? And no one wants to see that. And now Disney is removing the jokes as well, but then there's the crop by format, but it's not the only thing Disney. Is doing to the Simpsons, okay? You know, so they also removed a Michael Jackson episode. So they removed a st episode called Stock Waving Dad, the 1991 episode of the first season, is absent from Disney Plus. The infamous episode was not included because, of course, Disney is trying to. Uh, Avoid controversy, but you know, they're gonna put, you know, garbage like Captain Marvel on there. <laughs> you know, it's trash on, you know, Disney Plus. Um, that the uh, Stock Raven Dad 1991 installment kicked off the third season and it's completely gone. Now it begins with Mr. Visa, Mr. Visa Goes to Washington. It's probably labeled at number two on the chapters. Um, Disney, of course, did not respond because you know Disney only wants to, you know, they want to be all squeaky clean of everything, okay? So, only, and I think Disney will probably include it after the backlash, like you know, of the um, the whether that the censorship, um, you know, of the, the attempted censorship, they want to censor Dumbo as well, uh, remove the and the older movies, okay? We wanted that one, but it doesn't, it probably won't take long for Disney to sneak them out like they usually do. Okay, you know, I'm surprised Disney didn't put the trigger warnings on that one episode as well. So that's also there. And Disney Plus is making The Simpsons way worse. Okay, and of course, you know, the media is defending it. BuzzFeed, everybody's least favorite, you know, the most trustworthy media, second most trustworthy sarcasm media site besides media diversity reviews. That's also sarcasm because they both suck. Okay, and you know, They've made it in the wrong aspect video, which people have been complaining. And you know, Dragon Ball fans, we know how um, Dragon Ball fans have been complaining a long time that home media didn't do that. So it doesn't, but, but still, it's not as bad as what the Disney did to the, the Simpsons, okay? It's not as bad as what Disney did to the Simpsons, okay? And they work different and worse. So, Disney is altering the classic episodes, and there's nothing we can do about because Disney doesn't care. They only care about money. They only care about your freaking money, okay? You know, your freaking money matters more to Disney than your, um, satisfaction, okay? You know, Disney Plus is gonna do well for now because, you know, it has the Mandalorian, um, on there. And, but once that's gone, what does Disney Plus have? Nothing. It just has a bunch of old movies they can buy on Blu-ray. You know, bunch of old, you know, movies you can buy in Blu-ray. They're gonna probably try to attempt to remove, you know, 
those old movies on Blu-ray, and it's just not going to work because they're going to try to force, you know, Disney parts on everyone, okay? So basically, anyone who wants to watch these old Disney movies, okay, get a Blu-ray player and get the Blu-ray of it or DVD. Um, wow, wow, it's still left. Wow, you know, we have, you know, time before, you know, Disney pulls the plugs and puts those movies in the vaults all together. So, to those people who are saying, oh, we, the DVDs suck because they're too expensive or something like that, okay, you just buy it instead of Disney Plus because at least you'll be able to keep it forever. Unlike Disney Plus, where Disney will put some, movie, some movies forever and only have them out for like one month, and that's it. So, that's basically it. Goodbye.